Hello students. In today's class, we'll see one of the new method that is modified Euler's method. Here we'll see explanation of modified Euler's method and respective formulas. Details we'll see now. Hello students. We'll see today modified Euler's method. This is one of the updated method uh, than uh, Taylor's series method, I can say. So in this modified Euler's method, so we are going to consider the initial value problem that is consider the initial value problem that is dy by dx is equal to f of x comma y and y of x naught is equal to y naught as it is how we have seen in the Taylor's uh, series method so we need to find okay so we need to find what here y at x1 but x1 is nothing but what here it is x0 plus h so we need to find the y so what we have here so y of x1 we need to find understood the meaning of this is what here which is nothing but y of x1 we need to find so y of x0 they have given in the question itself so here we need to find y of what here x1 but this x1 is nothing but x0 plus h but here this h is nothing but step size okay so what here so first we need to find what here so it the meaning of this is what here y of x1 so what i can say so we first obtain what here y of x1 is equal to what here y1 you can observe here y of x0 is equal to y0 so therefore y of x1 is equal to what here y1 by by applying by applying Euler's formula we need to apply what here Euler's formula and this value is regarded as the initial approximation for y1 means once we got y of uh, uh, x1 is equal to y1 using Euler's formula so that is nothing but that value is regarded as the initial approximation for y1 usually it is denoted by so in Euler's formula it is denoted by y1 of 0 is equal to okay the Euler's formula is given by y1 of 0 is equal to y0 plus h into f of x0 comma y0 so this formula you need to remember so initially uh, we need to remember see uh, I can give one best example so you will write a paper in the examination so once you write up a, uh, a paper so after finishing uh, you will uh, plan what here how much I can score in this paper means you will predict it means you will uh, guess it so you have written uh, so and so questions uh, you will decide what here so I will score uh, uh, how much here uh, out of 100 I will score 70 marks in this subject so this what we are doing this is prediction means we are predicting I will score 70 marks in the in this so and so paper so that is nothing but Euler's formula means this is a prediction we are predicting this is my y1 value okay once the result comes means after paper correction the examiner will give the answer uh, means uh, marks for the particular answers and you will find your marks surrounding to what here your prediction what is your prediction 70 marks so your marks will be uh, maybe uh, a little bit less than 70 or little bit more than 70 it is uh, uh, near to what here you are uh, predicted so that is nothing but correction 
so that corrections what he uh, the examiner has done so for that we are using the uh, term as what here modified Euler's formula therefore I can say that since the accuracy is poor means in this from this accuracy is poor means my prediction is poor means maybe it is more or maybe it is less so I am not sure how much I can get it is not accurate value means you have written so you will get uh, uh, 70 marks means 70 marks maybe or may not be means we can say not accurate but we can predict it so therefore I can say that this is a predicted value of y1 that is a predicted value of y1 will get from the Euler's formula then to get more accurate we need to use modified Euler's formula so we'll see that one what is modified Euler's formula since the accuracy is poor in this uh, formula this value y1 is successfully improved that is corrected to desired degree of accuracy by modified Euler's formula where the successive approximations are denoted by so here what we have taken y1 of 0 initial approximation we'll test y1 of 1 y2 y1 of two, second approximation y1 of third approximation y1 of fourth approximation we have to do it successively uh, uh, same up to what here so the previous value and the next value supposed to be what here approximately same till that that many approximation we have to do it and we need to stop the and we need to find the result of that so what is this modified Euler's formula uh, uh, of a successive approximation I uh, will see now here so it is given by y1 of first approximation is equal to y0 plus h upon 2 into f of x0 comma y0 plus f of x1 y1 of first uh, uh, 0th approximation first formula first approximation second appro next approximation if you want to test so y1 of second approximation is y0 plus h by 2 f of the same it will be just we'll see what is the change plus f of x1 also same instead of y1 of 0 we'll write y1 of 1 here y1 of 1 means fresh value of y so this value of y1 we have taken what here from the uh, Euler's formula so once we got our uh, y1 from a modified Euler's that one we are we are going to use next if you want to test so y1 of third approximation is equal to y0 plus h by 2 f of x0 comma y0 plus f of x1 comma y1 of so y1 of second approximation value of here we'll replace and we'll test again if you want to uh, check so next y1 of fourth approximation is equal to y0 plus h by 2 into f of x0 comma y0 plus f of x1 comma y1 of third approximation what we got previous value of y so, so on we need to what here so on we need to do the same up to what here the previous approximation answer and the next approximation answer up to four decimal whatever they will ask or up to three decimal or up to five decimal it's supposed to be same and we need to stop and we need to conclude that this is the required uh, solution by using modified Euler's method so here what happens so this uh, method is also called Euler's predictor and corrector formula also this modified Euler's method is also going to call as what here Euler's predictor and corrector so each successive approximation is better than the uh, precedings that is previous one they are called corrected values means what fresh values we are going to get it is corrected one uh, from the expected what we have predicted and the Euler's uh, formula and modified Euler's uh, formula jointly are also called what here Euler's predictor and corrector formula so this is uh, just a theory what we have seen and uh, based on this problems we'll see